Growers face many challenges with weeds. Weeds are hated on the farm as they steal yield and increase agronomic management. In dealing with the hardest to control weeds, the top growers face difficult herbicide selection challenges based on ease of use, the weed spectrum, application timing, and tank mix flexibility. Let's meet two Alberta-based growers that hate yield-robbing weeds and are adopting leading-edge herbicides to take care of this problem. These two growers had access to a brand new herbicide called Luxor last summer to try out on their farm and see if it would be a good fit. I do hate weeds, yes. They rob of yield and too much competition for the crop to get the maximum potential. You think that you've done a good job over the years getting control of them and then conditions change and you end up with weeds showing up that you haven't seen in several years. They continue to rob us of our end goal of producing crops and so a thief would also be a good word for a weed. Every year there are weeds that are definitely on our must control list. Uh, you know, we've been fighting wild oats forever so we don't want to let up on controlling wild oats. There's lots of weeds that fall into that category that have been around for a long time. The cleavers would be the most problematic weed. Storksville is also tough. Hemp nettle's an issue and some flicks weed in places. White cockle is a perennial weed that very few products control and Luxar provides a higher level of activity than previous products. Uh, there was definitely a wild oat issue. Uh, it wasn't as big of an issue as the flick sweet or maybe the staging wasn't as bad, but it definitely was very good control. We have some difficult to control weeds that make our herbicide selection challenging. We always have to focus on the toughest weeds and it seems that the chemicals or the herbicides that control the toughest weeds also get the more common, easier to control weeds. Well, the biggest challenge is to picking the right herbicide is finding the herbicide that will control the weeds at the stage they're at. Luxor is different from a lot of products we've used in the fact that it is a broad spectrum herbicide that, that is all the same group. So Luxor is all group two. So it makes it easier to target herbicide rotation and uh, resistant management with a product like Luxor. Luxor was very good at uh, being compatible with many other products. Pulses are definitely becoming a larger part of my rotation, so it's really important to have a product like Luxor that is able to use a pulse after. There's some products that don't, you know, the early spray stage isn't very nice. You know, some of them you have to wait for four leaf stage. And, you know, when you're talking about yield loss, that early weed removal is the most important thing in most cases to maximize yield. I would say Luxor's uh, weed control is very good. Luxor provided quite exceptional weed control across the spectrum, provided us with the results that we were hoping for. I would recommend Luxor to growers who are struggling with perennial weed control options and uh, who require a group two product in their herbicide rotation. I would recommend Luxor uh, for sure, uh, given the situation we had on the dirty land and the staging of the weeds, the control that it was able to do, I definitely would recommend Luxor to others to use. Thank you.